Eye on Health, brought to you by Tallahassee Memorial Healthcare. Ovarian cancer is often called the silent killer because many times there are no symptoms until its later stages when the disease is already spread. That's why it's so important for women to understand these symptoms so they can seek immediate help from a specialist if they suspect there's a problem. Here to talk more about this disease is Dr. Arvind Bakru. Dr. Bakru, let's just jump right in and start with the symptoms. What are they? Well, ovarian cancer often spreads into the upper abdomen in a silent way, as you know, and it can include symptoms such as abdominal bloating, fullness, a change in the bowel or bladder habits that are not normal for that person, or just general gastrointestinal symptoms. So, I mean, these sound pretty common. What are the risk factors that might lead me to believe that there might be a bigger problem than just indigestion? Yeah, well, if they are persisting over time and those symptoms are not improving, then somebody should seek out other explanations and that one of those other causes could include ovarian cancer. Okay, so who's at risk? Women in their 50s are most at risk. Other risk factors include a pelvic mass or an ovarian cyst that is persisting or enlarging over time or symptoms that are worsening. Mm -hmm. Okay, if I'm diagnosed with um, ovarian cancer, what can the TMH Cancer Center do for me? The TMH Cancer Center has an expanding and new program for ovarian cancer. We have another physician who just joined us for this program as well. We offer everything from surgery to genetic testing to chemotherapy for people with ovarian cancer or recurrent disease. Okay, this is so important. We're going to talk again soon. Thank you. Thank you. To learn more about ovarian cancer and its treatment options, visit tmh.org cancer. Ion Health, brought to you by Tallahassee Memorial Healthcare.